My journey with visual arts started at age five through drawing and painting classes. Along the way, I also got involved in mixed media, fashion design, and sculpture. Working on creative projects was peaceful and it was comforting. It was an escape from reality. But the story that I unconsciously told myself was that this was not my reality. As a first generation Asian American with a different set of lived experiences, I often felt out of touch with the art history in artists I was taught to celebrate in school. Later on in college though, my perspective changed. I fell in love with contemporary artists like Jillian Waring, Yoko Ono, and Teaching Shea, who challenged what art could be and how it could look like. I also fell in love with festivals and public art and how these community activations can remove the barriers to access within the arts. These discoveries gave me the confidence not only to find a place, but to also fight for a place in the arts. Finally, I began to find my role models, my artistic voice, my purpose to create. My name is Grace Wong, and I'm a multidisciplinary visual artist, former arts administrator, and now arts educator. Through photography, participatory art, mixed media, and writing in my own work, I explore what place and belonging looks like. I examine untold histories, and I find opportunities to weave a more interconnected society. So many of us often feel lost and confused about who we are, what we can be, and the stories we feel we can or can't tell. For kids, this feeling is probably familiar as they navigate what their cornerstone for purpose is. Through art, I found a space to share and express my story in a way that was authentic to myself. And what I want to share to kids during Artist Year is that no matter what art means for each of us, whether it be relaxation, self-expression, or even challenging the status quo, Art has a place for everybody.